Once upon a time, in a future not too distant from our own, there lived a man named Elias, whose extraordinary journey would lead him to become the first king of planet Earth. Elias, an astrophysicist with a humble background, had always been fascinated by the stars and the vastness of the universe. However, his life took a dramatic turn when he discovered an ancient artifact buried deep within the Earth's crust. This artifact, a mysterious orb of glowing energy, was unlike anything known to mankind. It held within it the collective knowledge and wisdom of an advanced alien civilization. Elias, upon touching the orb, found himself endowed with incredible insights and a deep understanding of the universe. His newfound knowledge enabled him to solve some of the world's most pressing issues, such as climate change, poverty, and disease. As news of his miraculous achievements spread, people from all corners of the globe began to see Elias as a savior, a beacon of hope in a world riddled with problems. Nations, once divided by borders and beliefs, started to unite under his guidance. Elias, however, remained humble and focused on his mission to better humanity. The turning point came when a global assembly was held to address the future of Earth. It was there that the leaders of the world, moved by Elias's wisdom and selfless actions, proposed the idea of a unified Earth under a single leader. They unanimously agreed that Elias, with his extraordinary abilities and benevolent nature, was the ideal candidate to lead humanity into a new era. Thus, Elias was crowned as the first king of planet Earth, not through conquest or inheritance, but through the love and trust of the people. His reign was marked by unprecedented peace and prosperity. Under his rule, Earth became a thriving planet with advanced technologies and sustainable practices that ensured the well-being of all its inhabitants. King Elias, however, never forgot his roots. He often gazed up at the stars, reminded of the mysterious alien civilization that had changed his fate. He vowed to use his position not just for the betterment of Earth, but also to foster peaceful relations with any other intelligent beings in the cosmos. And so, the man who once looked up at the stars with wonder, now sat on a throne with the Earth beneath his feet, guiding humanity towards a brighter future, a testament to the idea that the most extraordinary changes can come from the most unexpected places. As King Elias led Earth into a golden age, his thoughts often turned towards the stars, the mysterious origins of the orb, and the possibilities of other intelligent life in the universe. His reign brought about a new era of exploration and innovation. With the knowledge from the orb, Elias spearheaded the development of interstellar travel technology, opening doors to the vast expanse of space. Under his guidance, Earth sent its first interstellar spacecraft, the Harmony, on a mission of peace and exploration. The Harmony, equipped with advanced technology and a crew representing the diversity of Earth, set out to discover new worlds and possibly other civilizations. Elias's dream was not only to extend the peace and prosperity of Earth to the stars, but also to find the beings who had unknowingly set him on his path to kingship. Meanwhile on Earth, Elias continued to foster unity among the people. He established a council of representatives from every nation, ensuring that all voices were heard and considered in global decisions. This council worked alongside Elias, addressing challenges and sharing the wonders of new discoveries from the Harmony's voyage. The Harmony's journey eventually led to a groundbreaking discovery, a planet inhabited by an intelligent species. This species, though technologically less advanced, was peaceful and curious. Elias, upon hearing of this, decided to make contact personally. In a historic moment, he joined the crew of the Harmony on their next voyage, becoming the first Earthling to set foot on an alien world. The meeting was a momentous occasion. Elias and the alien leaders exchanged knowledge, culture, and ideas. He learned that these beings had been aware of Earth for centuries and had observed humanity's growth and struggles with interest. They too had experienced similar challenges in their past and were eager to establish a friendship with Earth. Elias returned to Earth with a new vision. He saw a future where Earth was part of a larger community of intelligent beings, all sharing knowledge and living in harmony. He began working towards this future, ensuring that Earth's advancements in technology and sustainability were shared with their new friends fostering a relationship built on mutual respect and cooperation. Under King Elias's reign, Earth became a beacon of hope, not just for its inhabitants, but for the universe. His legacy was one of peace, exploration, and the unification of diverse beings. Elias, once a humble astrophysicist, had not only become the king of planet Earth, but a pivotal figure in the cosmic community, remembered for generations as the man who united worlds. The story of King Elias took a dramatic and dark turn when a delegation from a previously unknown alien civilization arrived on Earth. This civilization, vastly more advanced and enigmatic, 
expressed their desire to meet with King Elias, citing their admiration for his achievements. Eager to extend the hand of friendship to another interstellar race, Elias welcomed them with the hope of fostering yet another peaceful alliance. However, the intentions of these new visitors were far from peaceful. Concealing their true motives, they sought to destabilize the burgeoning interstellar community that Earth was spearheading, fearing the loss of their own influence in the galaxy. During a grand assembly organized to honor these visitors, tragedy struck. King Elias was assassinated, a victim of a sinister plot orchestrated by members of this alien delegation. The news of Elias's death sent shockwaves throughout Earth and the interstellar community. Grief and disbelief gripped the planet, as people from all corners of the world mourned the loss of a leader who had become a symbol of hope and unity. The Harmony, along with other civilizations that had befriended Earth, expressed their deep sorrow and solidarity. In the wake of this tragedy, the council established by Elias took swift action. They worked tirelessly to uncover the truth behind the assassination, revealing the malevolent intentions of the alien visitors. The council, however, remained steadfast in their commitment to Elias's vision of peace and unity. Instead of seeking revenge, they chose to honor Elias's legacy by continuing his work, strengthening the bonds between Earth and its interstellar allies, and advocating for peace and understanding. The assassination of King Elias became a pivotal moment in Earth's history. It served as a stark reminder of the fragility of peace and the importance of vigilance in the face of hidden threats. However, it also reinforced the ideals that Elias had championed, that cooperation, understanding, and unity were the keys to a prosperous future, both for Earth and for the interstellar community at large. Elias's legacy lived on, not only in the memories of those he had inspired, but also in the continued efforts of Earth and its allies to build a peaceful and united galaxy. His dream of a harmonious universe, where different civilizations could learn from and support each other, became a guiding light for future generations. King Elias, even in death, remained a symbol of the unyielding spirit of humanity and its enduring quest for peace among the stars.